Hello, everybody, and welcome back in the Fantaco Coliseum. The Toronto Wild Hounds on a roll right now. They start the first two games. Yeah, and this is just how it is. Wild Hounds have found a way. Andrew Hammond again, sharp last game, only allowing a goal after a shutout the previous game before. So a 7 nothing win, then a 2-1 win last game, and two actual home wins here for the Wild Hounds to start the eight-game homestand. Draw here at center ice. One back, and it's picked up by the Firebirds. Lawand is in the zone. In they come. Wilsmer trying to set it up. Home back to his zone. That goes behind. Holzer plays it in front, and Hammond is going to cover. That's what they want to do here. And here we go. Face off here to the right side of the goal. And it's one back by the Wild Hounds. Cleared ahead. Here's Brickley. Finding Thomas ahead with speed. So the first time these two played, Toronto held on 5-4 against the Firebirds back in Flint. Flint is never easy to play back in Flint. Asantiak gets it ahead. Holm chasing after it in the corner. Looking up ice. Holm is there. St. Dennis. Holm. Thomas. Brickley over the line. Just dumps it in. Far side meeting there is St. Dennis with a shot to the goal. Handled. Thomas back in front. St. Dennis looking for the centering pass. And here come the Firebirds. In with a shot off the blocker of Hammond. And Toronto's going to clear it. Not out. Tucker centers. Wismer in front. Stopped by Hammond again. Brickley plays it down the ice. And this will be icing against the Wild Hounds. Yeah, what a start here for the Firebirds so far. They're getting the puck to the net, creating dangerous chances. And Toronto looks like they've been on their heels a bit here to start this hockey game. Draw one, Busby, he gave it away. Brickley overskated the puck, pokes it back in. Robert is there. Home, Condra. And that's given away to McCourt at center. Ahead to Kepin. In comes Flint to the net. Stopped in the rebound, Hammond all over that as well. Clear down the ice again by the Wild Hounds. This will be another icing call as it's touched up by McCourt. Yeah, you have to be ready for any possible opportunity here. And Flint has been all over the Wild Hounds here in the early going. And guess who's been sharp? Andrew Hammond. Wild Hounds decided to wear their alternates again in tonight's game. They're coming off a 2-1 win. And they are wearing the uniforms in that game as well. Home. Holzer. Kadra. Here's Welsh ahead, home, off the boards and down the ice. Brickley after it, trying to beat out the icing call, he does. Great play to race there and get to that puck and beat out the icing. Kepin takes the hit, a big one, and now Welsh back to the puck center and Brickley. He'll find Welsh in the zone, dropping for Condra a shot. That's stopped by Cavillan, and he plays it out to McCourt. Under eight minutes to go, first period tied at zero. Big crushing hit, and now we're going to have a fight between Holzer and Yuli. Yeah, this is going to be a good fight. Yuli's getting the fist in there now. Here goes Holzer out of nowhere. Look at Holzer go. Yuli gets one in there, and Holzer pummels him to the ice. What a fight here in front of the home fans. That was a big fight, and I did not expect that. Wow. What a punch by Corbini and Holzer. So that fight's over. Now the faceoff to the right side of the Toronto goal with 7.24. They go in the opening frame, tied at zero. Wrong one back. Here's Lenoir, and that's blocked. And Kitchen couldn't get it. And another save by Hammond. Big hit along the boards. Tucker to the front. Cressier, he's stopped by Hammond as well. Put out to Broadhurst. He plays it down the ice. Trying to beat it out and does. Back to the front. Centers to Broadhurst. And that rolls off the side of the goal. Back in front. Morgan's there. Trying to center. Gave it away to Beck. He goes to the corner for it. Lenoir. And here come the Flint Firebirds. Big hit along the boards. Luchik to Beck. Over the red line, clears it in for Toronto. Far side is Broadhurst to the goal. With a move and a good try there. Broadhurst taken down in the corner. Fans wanted a penalty. There won't be one. Here's Morgan to Kressler. Off the bench. Line change now. Breen is on for Toronto and he gets by him. Great save, Hammond. What a save by Andrew Hammond on that fake to the net. Kressler can't believe that that puck didn't go in. How about the chance on Cavillan? Had to be ready, gets the pad out as it rolls off the stick of the Wildhounds. That could have been a great opportunity. 
The draw. One back by Toronto. Regner clearing it not out. Wismer center. They score in front of the goal off a turnover. And they finally beat Andrew Hammond. It's Delandria. And it is 1-0 Flint late here in period one. They put it to the net off another bad giveaway by the Wildhounds. They're sand their puck watching. The lane is open right between the legs of Hammond. And it's 1-0 Flint here in the first. The faceoff. That's one back. Here's McCourt. Gives it away. St. Dennis right in. Shoots. That stop. Great try the other way by the Wildhounds. Picked up here by Busby. Time running out in the first. Here's Asentiak. Gets by with a step to the net. Hammond's all over it easily. Plays it out. Wismer's in front. He's stopped by Hammond. And that'll do it for the first period. The Firebirds bring a 1-0 lead into the locker room here tonight in Toronto after one. Shot to goal, 8 for Flint, 5-4 Toronto, hits 7-0 Toronto, face-offs 4-3 Flint. No power plays, 1-0 Flint after 1. Welcome into period 2 here from Toronto, the Wildhounds trail, 1-0 after 1. Here's the face-off. And it is 1 back by Flint. Lawan brings it in, here's Lawan to the net, and he's stopped by Hammond. Toronto's playing a third night in a row. This is insane. I'm surprised they gave them a schedule playing three games in a row. Tucker in. He shoots. That's stopped by Hammond. Played ahead to Brickley ahead. He'll just shoot it wide of the goal. Thomas back to it in front. That rolls to Cavillan. He'll easily hold on here for Flint. Yeah, the Wildhounds 7-0 in the first game. And uh, who was that against again? I can't remember. Draw one back. But then the... Oh, it was against the Barry Colts, I believe. And then you had 2-1 last game against the Otters. And tonight it's 1-0 Flint currently. Toronto playing a third night in a row. Here's St. Dennis, a shot. That deflected, but didn't go in. Lawan. Here's Wismer, and here comes Asentiak for the Firebirds in the zone. To the net. That's stopped by Hammond. Off the boards and not out. Brickley ahead. Here's Wismer back in. In shoots. Stopped by Hammond. Home. To the puck, but can't get it out. Toronto stuck in their zone. Another shot. Block it aside by Hammond. And what a period for Andrew Hammond so far. Yeah, he's had to be sharp, and he has been. Here's another play. That shot blocked in front. But they somehow get it back now. It's played off the boards and down the ice. By the Wild Hounds. Not enough for icing. Busby crushed along the boards. Welsh throws it. That goes behind. Here's Prouda shot. That stopped in front of the goal. Kadra off the side of the post. McCourt. Here's Roberts, here comes Piercy, and here might be a 2-on-1 to the goal. Stopped by Hammond, just got a piece. Playing it back to Prout, he clears it back down the ice, and that is on goal. Cavillan, here's Busby ahead. Piercy, here come the Flint Firebirds to the net. Kippen, kick save there by Hammond on the screen. Piercy back in front, another shot, he scores! Piercy gets the shot away. Makes the Wild Hounds pay, and it's 2-0 Firebirds here in the second. Riley Piercy just puts the puck to the net. Toronto's stuck in the zone. They can't get it out. They're tired. They're playing a third night in a row, and you can tell that they are a tired team here tonight. So it's now a 2-0 lead for the Firebirds. Face-off coming. And it is one back by the Firebirds. Here's Deline. Looks ahead and finds help. And Morgan to the goal. That's blocking aside by Hammond. Now again, Yuli in front for Pierce. Pierce to Yuli. Stopped again, Hammond. Here it's loose again. Morgan in front. They score. A 3 nothing lead as Pierce puts it in for the Firebirds. And they're silent here in Toronto tonight. Well, when you're playing a third night in a row, nothing's going to be easy. And this game has not been easy for the Wild Hounds. A 3-0 lead for the Firebirds. Here's the draw. And it is one back by the Firebirds. Gretz has it. Ahead to Pierce. And Pierce is in. Centers to Yuli. That's stopped by Hammond. He'll hold on with 6-12 to go in the second period. Oh, what a period here right now for the Flint Firebirds. Just putting full pressure on. The Wild Hounds are not reading it well. Draw one, Deline, that's stopped as well. Big hit along the boards, Beck looking to get out of the zone and finds Broadhurst and does exactly that. Luchik over the line, picked up by Broadhurst, he'll bring it in with Beck. Beck drops it in front, has help in Regner, that backhander blocked towards the goal to get it back with four minutes to go in the period, but Yuli's the one on it. Here's Yuli for the Firebirds. 
in the corner looking from behind. Green to it for Toronto. Smith. Here's Beck. Yuli gets it back to Gretz in front. Wismer trying to get the center and pass across to Landria. Big hit there. And here come the Wildhounds. The pass ahead to Smith. Smith a shot. Scores! That one went through with two minutes to go in the second period. It's a 3-1 game. Cavillan came too far out. And of course, the Wildhounds made him pay for it. It's a 3-1 game. Late in the second period, a goal, and the fans finally have something to cheer about here in Toronto. Liz Moran looking to the goal. Centers it in front to Andrea, and a kick stop him in there. Smith back to it. Here's Smith. He'll circle back to his own zone and go behind his goal. So it was a 1-0 game after one. It's 3-1 late here in the second period. Picked up again. Big hit along the boards. Wildhounds trying to dig that puck free. Asentiek to Delandria. That's out to Farnham. He'll clear it down the ice and that'll do it for two. 3-1 lead for the Firebirds after two here tonight from Toronto. Shot to go in the game. 21 for Flint with three. Seven for the Wildhounds with one. The hit's 13-3 Wildhounds. Faceoffs 10-3 Flint. No power plays. 3-1 Flint after two. Welcome into the third period here from Fantaco Coliseum. Wildhounds down by two goals to start the third. First time they're trailing going into the third period. 3-1 this season. St. Dennis has it. And now it's to Landria. Ahead. Wismer. Down the left wing and in. Holds her back to defend for Toronto. And he did steal it but lost it back in the corner. Now ahead. on to the puck. Brickley. A ice holds her. He finds his man and Christian Thomas pulls her back. Here's Brickley in with a shot. Big save there. Milan along the board. Toronto trying to set something up. Holm giving away and Wismer the oil man there. And here come the Firebirds in the zone. Big hit there as he's taken down. Brickley. Here's St. Dennis. Looks up ice and finds Christian Thomas again with a move. Here's Christian Thomas. What a move he scores! Oh my goodness. What a goal by Christian Thomas. And it's a 3-2 game. So Christian Thomas with a highlight real goal gets Toronto back within one here in the third period. Three to two. Draw one. Here's Lawan with it. Gives it away. It goes into the corner of the Firebird zone. He's after him and takes him down. Here's the pass in front of the goal. Backhanded wide of the mark. Wells trying to get back in there. Lawan. King has the puck. Drops it in front. Tucker gang in the way. Here's Tucker and here come the Firebirds. Wells trying to hold it in. Big hit. King has help with him. Pass in front. They score. Welsh and the game is tied at three. This Wildhound team is something else. Back from a 3-0 deficit, the Wildhounds just get the puck to the net off a turnover. It's a 3-3 tie. Looking for a 13th consecutive victory, playing a third night in a row. They were down 3-0. They're back from 3-0. We're tied here in the third. Raw one back. Proud ahead. Here's Welsh a shot off the faceoff. Stopped by Cavillan easily. And he wants the cover here for Flint. I would be covering as well if I were Flint right now. There goes a 3-0 lead and the Firebirds can't believe it. Draw here. It's one back and picked up by Proud a shot off the blocker easily steered away. Welsh setting up. Here's Kitchen a shot. That steered aside as well. McCourt in the corner with it. Lost the puck. It's set up to King. He plays it in front. Kept in the oil man there. The Piercy and out to center. Big hit. They're right back in the zone. Busby but offside against Toronto. 10-21 to go in the game. Wildhounds, Firebirds, three aside. Yeah, two goals here in the third for the Wildhounds. And one late in the second period. And we're tied at three. Piercy dumps it in. Proud after the puck for Toronto. Broadhurst. 
Ahead, that's giving away Piercy. Roberts is in. He shoots. That goes wide. Toronto up the board. Here's Kitchton to Beck. And here comes Beck for Toronto. Slows down in the zone. Busby gave it away. It's kept in by Toronto. Lucic gets it in deep. He'll drop it back to Beck. Setting up home across the Prout. He's taken down on the play. No call. Roberts to Busby. And out they come again. Lucic back to the fen. He steals the puck. And here comes Lucic in the zone for the move. Busby in front. Lucic all over him. Pokes it to the net. And Cavillan will hold on with 5.27 to go in regulation. So a 3-3 tie here in Toronto between the Wild Hounds and the Firebirds. The draw. One back. St. Dennis trying to peel it off the draw. Pierce is there. Here's Pierce in his own end. Having trouble with the puck. Gets it ahead. Finding Morgan. They just want to get it out right now. Here's Yuli. Brickley trying to hold it in. He stole it. Pass to the front of the net. And McCourt gets his stick in the way. Great play by McCourt to get back and defend. Here the other way come the Firebirds. Big hit. And it's Toronto's puck with two and a half to go here in the third now. St. Dennis can't get it. Yuli's back in with Morgan to Yuli. He hit the crossbar. Toronto has the puck. They throw it back behind to Brickley. He'll find his man in St. Dennis. Yuli along the boards. Looking to get it to the front of the net. Picked up again by the Wild Hounds. And here comes St. Dennis. Over the red line and in. Far side meeting there is Christian Thomas taking down his man, but no one back to help. Welsh trying to get at center ice. Kitchton back. Here's a chance for the Firebirds, a lot of open ice. Lalonde back to it in front. Center and pass, 40 seconds left in the game. Welsh pokes it along. Condra, here's King, and here comes Toronto. They gave it away. Lalonde having trouble with that puck. King stole it from him twice, and now Sentiak to Pierce gets it right back in. 25 seconds left in the period. Toronto has the puck. Welsh can't get it out. Here's a pass from the corner in front of the goal. Prout the stick there. Here comes King for Toronto. Here's King trying to drop it off. Has help with him in Prout. Across. Here's Kitchen in. And that's stopped by Cavillan with seven seconds to go in the third. Tied at three. Well, the Wild Hounds, last thing they want to do is go to overtime. This would be their first overtime as a hockey team. Draw one back. Here it is. Here's Rayner a shot. Blocked. Broadhurst a shot. That one knocked down through traffic in front. And we are going to have overtime tonight. Here from Toronto, the Firebirds carry out a point. Yeah, and they're going to carry out a point big time here tonight. Had a 3 0 lead and blew it. Wildhounds still get a point. We go to overtime. Tied at three. Shot the goal 22 for Flint. 16 for Toronto. The hit 17 to 6 Flint. Face us 14 to 6 Flint. No power plays. 3 3 after three. Toronto playing a third night in a row, and you got to give them credit for forcing overtime here tonight. Down 3-1 to one to start the third. They force overtime tied at three. St. Dennis to take the draw. And he wins it back and gets the pass. St. Dennis in. Looking. Circles back. Has help off the boards. Gets it over to Brickley. Brickley in for St. Dennis. The Landria stick the only one there. Holds her back to the fin and steals it for Toronto. First overtime for the Wild Hounds in history. St. Dennis drops it in front. Here's Holzer looking for a lane. He gave it away to Landria. Here come the Firebirds. St. Dennis, the only man back. And in the shot. Stopped by Hammond. He'll cover here in overtime for the Wild Hounds. Too much open ice given up there by the Wild Hounds. And they got to be better defensively here in overtime. Playing a third night in a row. I know it's not easy, but you have to be better than that. You're right. Well, Juan gives it away. Break away in overtime to win it. He's in. He shoots. And it's stopped. Gets it back in front. St. Dennis looking for the pass. Brickley again. That's stopped. They score. In overtime. The Wild Hounds back from 3 0. Get it in overtime. 4 to 3. First overtime in history. And it's an overtime win for an answer goal for the Wild Hounds. They come all the way back. Playing a third consecutive night in a row. And they, were, and they win it a third consecutive night in a row. So a big save on the breakaway, and then they get it back in front of the goal for a beautiful tap-in winner. And the final score, 4-3 Wild Hounds in overtime.